I did not expect to be back on this game so soon, but I'm definitely not complaining. I'm excited about this. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Wolfenstein 2. Today, we are going to be checking out the first DLC for this game. That's right, guys. This game came out like two weeks ago, and we've already got DLC. So this is pretty exciting. So it's here under SAS Machine. It's called Freedom Chronicles. I've got this first one right here. The Freedom Chronicles Episode Zero. This is the Freedom Chronicles Three stories of heroes bound by fate, determined to stop the Nazis, and free America. So uh, this is kind of like a, a little spin-off here. We're not actually going to be playing as BJ Blazkowicz. We're going to be playing as these three new characters who have all sorts of new kind of abilities and specialties and stuff like that. And um, I've heard nothing but good things. This just released like 24 hours ago or something like that. So I uh, hope you guys are ready. Let's go ahead and hop into it. The last glimpses of hope have faded from the world and terror has overwhelmed the planet. <laughs> As the land of the free is engulfed by the enemy, three heroes rise against injustice to fight for the American dream. This is the Freedom Chronicles, three thrilling tales of action and adventure for all <laughs> freedom-loving Americans. <laughs> it's got like a, a bald eagle screeching Look, in the background. Joseph Stallion. AKA Gunslinger Joe, a former professional quarterback enslaved by the Reich. After a public display of defiance against his oppressors, Joe was captured by Uber Commandant Roderick Metzer, an American dentist turned Nazi collaborator. But Joe was a man who wouldn't be caged. During his escape from Metzer's research station Omega in Springfield, Illinois, Joe encountered a garage full of Panzerhunden, and it gave him an idea. <laughs> Dude, this is ridiculous, but I love it so much. All right, enter the Panzerhund storage. We've got our varsity jacket on here. I'll take that extra health. So we just escaped our capture. And I think we're going to be trying to steal a Panzerhund. We'll see how this goes. I don't know the, the correct way to take this on. I guess we'll take out the Nazi scum first and then get the... Nice. Got him. Okay. I was trying to be stealthy. I didn't want to have to go live, but there was no way we were going to be able to take that robot without going live. So we're going to be dropping down here. Unnecessary roughness. Joe's used a football training have taught him how to hit hard. Joe could ram through weakened walls. Anyone brave or stupid enough to stand in his way? Activates when you're sprinting. Okay. I'm gonna grab some of this armor and stuff first. What's up, bitches? That was beautiful. I'm pretty. Oh my god. <laughs> yep, there was somebody right on the other side of that wall. That's uh, that's pretty brutal, man. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pick all this stuff up. Do we have any new. We've got our machine pistol, and we've also got this AR here. Okay, so it looks like we've got two... Open the storage area doors. We've got two commanders in here. One of them's right there, and I think the other one might be below us. We've got to get below. Okay, that guy's going. Just gonna follow him down, see where he's going. Gotcha. <sighs> of course, he's coming this way. I'm 
I'm watching the number up top. He's close. Did we just get a silenced pistol? We don't have the silencer on it. Oh, that would have been perfect. That's fine though. Dude, look at all these Panzerhund parts and pieces and all kinds of stuff. Okay. Now the other one's directly up above us, but I don't know how to get in there. We didn't have an entrance from the other side, so I'm gonna try going up and seeing if we can get in from this side over here. All right, here we go, boys. I'm trying to be stealthy here, just because I like being stealthy in this game, but... I don't want to be too slow. Slow is smooth and smooth is fast, baby. Oh, shoot, we can use our charge attack to break through that, okay. Where'd he go? He moved to that side. Oh, this is what we wanted anyway. All right, boys, let's go. Jeez. Homie was right behind us, I had no clue. All right, I did see a a big mech, didn't I? Yep. We've got a big mech. What's our, our current objective? Steal a, a Panzerhund. Woo! I'm not sure where the Panzerhund is, so I'm just gonna try to, to kill all these guys, and then we're gonna worry about it. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and switch. We're down to 20, 23 health, boys. All right. I'm gonna need some uh, some reinforcements here. Armor. Woo! Dude, there's so much going on right now. I'm just, I'm trying. Our objective's down on the ground. We might be able to run down there. I think I see a turret over here as well. Get me out of here. Where are the big ones at? Gotcha, baby. Try to save this for the big boys. There was a second big boy, wasn't there? Let's go, baby. Oh, there's another one. Sit down. Woo! I think we just got normal people to deal with now. We good? Holy cow. All right, good job, Mr. Quarterback. So this is our objective right here. Oh, we're gonna have to open this up with those those guns. We gotta go back up top and get that gun. We gotta melt this thing open. Here we go, boys. So we're... Where'd we kill one of them? Oh, the... will fire ones melt it? Fire ones do not melt it. Okay, there's gotta be... Dude, I'm pretty sure we used all of this one. Oh, there's a second one. Oh, we've, we've got ammo. Let's go, baby. Yes, sir. Time to wake up, my beauty. Oh. This is my favorite, this is a reminiscent of my favorite mission from the game, dude.
These things are way Joe too much fun. for a collision course with Uber Commandant Metza. Would Joe escape Research Station Omega? Find out for yourself in The Adventures of Gunslinger Joe. <laughs> While Gunslinger Joe and other brave Americans were fighting across the United States, one woman took on the Nazis from the shadows. And her former British OSS agent, Jessica Valiant, a.k.a. Agent Silent Death. Hot on the trail of a sinister plot, Agent Silent Death found herself in the offices of Paragon Pictures, once a purveyor of Tinseltown's finest films, now a Nazi propaganda machine. Would Agent Silent Death find her target, the Nazi collaborator Chuck Lorenz? Uh-oh, all right, here we go, guys. So this is uh, Mission 2, Character 2 of this DLC. Found my way inside. Wasn't too much hassle. Now, to find where Mr. Lorenz is hiding. Mr. Lorenz, we're coming for you, dude. This is sick. So we've got that silencer. Her name is Agent Silent Death. I would say we're probably going to be uh, a little bit stealthier than this second one here. This is kind of exciting. So we're in like a, a Nazi movie studio here. All right, this is awesome. Years of intense training in the OSS has allowed Agent Silent Death to control her body to fit in small openings, allowing her access to areas that would normally be considered too small for humans to pass. This is cool. All right, we're crouched here. There we go, look at that. We've got a commander close. Look at William Blaskowicz up there. That puppy's... Not gonna be easy to deal with. So we've got the commander and his dog over there. We've got a guy right here. I don't, dude, I don't, I don't like the dogs. They sniff you out. I don't think there's any way we're going to get around that dog. We're going to have to do some sneaking here. We've got to get over into that room, I think. I don't think we're going to get by that guy. He's kind of an awkward, awkward position. Um, we might... Might have to wait until the commander and his dog walk. I told you, man, I don't like dogs. Dude, holy cow, <laughs> this is insane. I'm just gonna wait in here for a second. I mean, the, the dog's down, that's the, the big part. Nothing here it seems.
There's so many guys. I've, I come like I'm ducking down trying to look out this thing. There's so many guys here right now. Looks like they've reassumed their posts. Kind of missed the the melee there, and and it was more of like a a throwing knife. All right, we've got to go get this commander, dude. This is actually really fun, though. I like this a lot. I like stealth missions. All right, this room's clear, boys. Is there anything over here? Looks like that's where we would want to go. I'm gonna check to make sure nobody's over here. There are two guys over here. I need one of you guys to move. Somebody has to go somewhere. We honestly probably don't even need to kill him. Pretty sure we could simply go this way. I hope we're going the right way. I have no clue, dude. Ooh, yeah. Yes, we are. Gonna eliminate all possible enemies here. We can find. <clears throat> We've got a big boy out there. There's, there's a second level to this. That's where that other guy is. The other officer. This guy's gonna be a problem. He moves though. So we've got one doing circles in the middle and then we've got this guy moving around.
I just don't see the way up top. I thought that room over there was gonna have the stairs to get up top. We gotta get up top and get the second. This has to be something then. I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna try going through here. Ah. Uh, Okay. Well, that was that was really dumb. We, we were literally walking in circles. Okay, we're we're okay now. We found the stairs. So the commander is pretty much exactly opposite us right now. What's our objective? Chuck Lorenz's office. This is pretty cray cray. No chance. No chance we're sneaking by those fools this way. Is that the commander? Or is that the commander? Dude, I'm gonna I'm gonna go the other way. There's no chance. Will he see us through these slats? Nope. There's no chance we were gonna get by all those guys. I, I was gonna try to go like the middle level, the bottom level, they're, they're literally every level, we'd be so screwed. This is gonna be our play here. <laughs> Gotta love the silenced pistol, baby. Gets us out of a bind. Trying to take down as many people as possible just so we don't have to deal with them later. There's the Commandant right there. This has to be our objective. All right, I'm not gonna skip the vault this time or the, the little vent. All right, search the office. Is there anybody in here? I find it kind of baloney to tell me to search the office when I don't know what I'm searching for. Got it! Let's go, boys! Jessica Valiant was gunning for Chuck Lorenz, but could she get to him in time? Read all about it in The Diaries of Agent Silent Death. As Jessica Valiant pursued her prey, another hero from the war was fighting a very different battle. U.S. Army Captain Gerald Wilkins, renowned for his brave deeds during the war, had been on the run since the Nazis atom-bombed Manhattan. Captain Wilkins was on a mission to destroy the deadliest weapon ever made, the Sun Gun. But first, he had to infiltrate the cannons of Kodiak Island. Going up to Alaska, boys. Here we go. All right, so this is the third and final mission as a part of this first Episode Zero DLC, kind of like an intro. <laughs> Mechanical actuator system containing a stolen pair of boots activated on demand once activated. Oh, oh yeah. This is like... Now we're in business. Look how beautiful it is Time inside. to find those cannons. Okay, this guy's kind of a badass, huh? But this is like what we had, this is what we chose for BJ's ability. Check 
that. Okay. We've got a robot. We've got some human enemies. Another robot over there. Er hat mir erzählt, dass das Sonnengewehr eine ganze Region der amerikanischen Gebiete ausradieren könnte. Oh, we, we put an attachment on our weapon. Okay, cool. I was going to say, that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense to me. There's all sorts of weird things going on, but this guy's coming right here. Okay, he was... He was quick on the trigger, man. I was trying to be kind of sneaky. I guess that wasn't the plan, though. This thing's pretty strong. Took down those robots like light work. I'm gonna pick up any ammo I can get. I saw some more weapons over here. There we go, baby. All right. Should we just go weapons live then? We're gonna try to be a smart weapons live. It's so, like we're gonna try to take down this commander before we actually go weapons live, but then we can go weapons live, if that makes sense. Commander's pretty far away here. Whew. Will this guy turn around? That's the question. We do have that boost ability. We can't forget about that. I don't know if it's gonna help us out in this area, really. Thirty-eight, and he's over there somewhere. So we've got two big guys. We've got lots of explosive barrels in the area. We gotta remember that. I'm gonna try to get all the way up top. Lots of levels to this one. Nobody in there. I just really want to kill this commander before he, he calls in the, uh, the reinforcements. There's already a ton of guys in here. There were lots of supplies over there, but I'm not gonna risk opening them up. Oh, there's a drone. If I was a commander, where would I be? In there is the answer. Dog. Holy shit. Nope. I'll pass. Well, we got a checkpoint. I kind of want to fight these guys, though. We got him.
We're down to 18 health, dude. I'm gonna go back up over here. We might be able to push on. I kind of want to fight these guys, though. It's, I mean, what's, where's the fun in, in running? You know what I mean? We gotta break these open. And I, I need health like a mother sucker. Dude, this, this single shot is actually really, really, really good. Like insanely good how fast this thing kills. I'll take some more armor. We're just prepping up for our next section. We were a little bit low anyway. All right, we should be looking good on ammo and armor now. I don't think I used a single shot weapon in in most of the actual campaign. And I should have, dude, this thing wrecks. Anybody else want some? No? I think we're good. Dude, we came in the exact wrong side. If we, when we were coming to get that commander, if we would have came down this side, Boom, he's right there, donezo, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. We came in the side that had the guy with the freaking dog, of course. All right, we're good, boys. Whoo! Guns blazing, but we're smart about it. Destroy the cannon. We missed. It's kind of an awkward angle, like it's hard to... There it is. Woo! Captain Wilkins always completed his mission, but could he put an end to the wrath of the sun gun? Don't miss the deeds of Captain Wilkins. From the mind of the great author and Chrysal rebel Curtis Everton comes The Freedom Chronicles. Three tales of inspiring action and adventure during the fight against the Nazis occupying America. A trilogy of stories from the resistance that will lead to the downfall of the global Nazi regime. Get them today. Terrorist propaganda. Ban them all. <laughs> all right. Is that it? Man, that makes me sad that that's, that's all we can get. So uh, you guys can see here, though it, there's kind of like an intro. So like the, the, that's episode zero, that's the intro, it introduces you to it. And then in the future, we're gonna get one, two, three DLCs to follow those storylines. And uh, it's gonna be all new, all new Wolfenstein gameplay. So it's cool. So if you guys remember in the main game, we had that when we were beheaded and then they saved us, we had that choice of whether we wanted the leg upgrade, the charging attack upgrade, or the stealth kind of like squeeze upgrade. And now this kind of explores all of those. So we're able to get the charge, the squeeze, and the legs. So uh, that's kind of cool, man. I'm excited about it. Let me know what you guys thought. Thank you guys so much for watching this little mini series. And uh, if you guys want to see this DLC as it comes out, I have no clue what the ETA is on that. Uh, but uh, let me know and we can definitely do that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to catch you guys later. Peace out.